Hey guys, it's Brian with PS4 Trophies, and today I am going to show you how to be an online hacking pro. So I'm going to jump into the first game here. I'm going to walk you through the entire process here, and then I'm going to show you uh, uh, three other ones in the final minute where it gets a little bit more difficult. But when you first get in the game, you're going to have to find your target and then hack them. So I use an SUV or a van is my preferred vehicle, but I use a vehicle and then I park it in an inconspicuous spot, uh, some place where the other player is not going to think it's kind of out of place. So I'm just going to park it right over here, which is near my hacking target. Let's see if we can line this up so it looks like a NPC parked it there. All right, so now I'm going to hack my target. You can use a camera to uh, hack them, but I don't see one here in range. So I'm going to go ahead and hack it. I'm run over there and hack them, and then I'm going to run back to my uh, my van. And you'll see here why in just a moment. All right, so now that we've started the hack, we got to start uh, initiate the backdoor installation. So I'm going to go over here to my cover, and now I'm going to initiate the installation. Now all I'm going to do is keep him in view, and you can see his little purple arrow there. Uh, sometimes the arrow, depending on his location, will disappear and you'll lose sight of him. Like I just did. Oh, there it is. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to maneuver around this van. As he passes uh, to the right, I'm going to kind of swing around to the back of the van and vice versa. And I can see him through the van. Now he can't see you. So you have the advantage here. Now every 25%, the uh, target range, the area in which that he's going to search in is going to get smaller and we're at 23 so it's about to get smaller and you can see him uh, through the back window of the van now the search area is shrinking now when it gets to uh, 50 percent it'll shrink once more and at 75 it's going to get really small and uh, it's going to be pretty obvious where I'm at but he's still not going to be able to find me and he hopped over the fence I have no idea where he's going there he is. He's hopping over the fence there, so I'm just going to swing around the van, and I'm just going to remain in cover and then use the uh, corner ability to, to navigate uh, my position around the van. All right, so now the uh, search area is going to shrink, and he's going to come back this way because he was outside the, uh, the circle there. And this just really just pisses people off. They have no idea. If he was smart, he would try blowing up the van. I've actually had a couple of people do that, and I still survived the uh, explosion. I do have the skill that uh, reduces the amount of damage taken from explosion, so that probably helps. And he's searching around back behind those houses. All right, now we're going to hit 75% here, and that search area is going to get really small. And looking at that, uh, the mini map there in the bottom right, it's kind of obvious where I'm at. There's not many places you can hide. He'll never find me. Just going to keep circling around the van here. And you can tell he's getting desperate. Now, if you do this in an area where there's a camera, uh, he can hack into that camera and use it to search for you. There is no camera where I'm at, so he can't use it to, against me. Although most players don't do it, but that is a technique. All right, so that's uh, that's the first one. I did this I was successful 10 out of 11 attempts. So here's another attempt. I'm going to show you just the final 25%. And he's back there behind the this vehicle. You can see him. Another technique, uh, if he was smart, is when the, especially when it gets to 75%, is to use a jam comms, because that'll sh uh, shut down the installation temporarily. But I find most players also don't do that as well. So he's completely baffled. He has no idea where I'm at. And I've been here out in the middle of the intersection this whole entire time. So there we go. That was a that was another attempt there. 
This is also an excellent way to get XP. You get about a thousand XP, and you can level up pretty quickly. So in this one here, I couldn't find a, a, a good vehicle. Again, I like to use an SUV or a van. So I uh, took the ice cream truck out. And again, I'm just going to keep circling around it. I have no idea what the Portmore killer is doing over there. Must think I'm up on the grass. Only because he searched around these vehicles pretty heavily early in the uh, uh, in the event. So there we go, and uh, we got uh, a woman here who was completely baffled about where I'm at. She uh, she went up on the L tracks above me, which is another a good uh, good thing because if you park near that, a lot of people will search up there. So here's the final one. I do get the trophy because you get the half a hackification trophy if you complete ten of these. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and you are now an online hacking pro.